Grand Rising Citizens, this is the Neo Tokyo News Broadcast. NFA raises $275,000. Sitcap 6 Investment is here to protect. Pacer rewards you for good habits. Some gaming giants are getting together for a webinar. Not even CZ's BNB is safe from hacks and how Alex Becker is contradicting himself. This is your weekly recap for all your crypto, gaming, metaverse and NFT affairs. Live from the heart of the Citadel, here's what's making news. Greetings, everybody, and welcome back to the Neo Tokyo News Broadcast. I'm your host, Outer Citizen Shumsi, number 769, bringing you the news powered by the NT News team. If you enjoy this type of stuff, you know what to do. First up, Damon Needs to Create wants to take us a little back in time. Tuesday the 4th of October was the one year S1 Identity Mint anniversary and the VC was vibrant as ever. It was perfect. People going in and out of the VC like a busy train station. Conversations of all nature filled the room with a great deal of nostalgia in the air. You were reminded of how powerful a VC can be within a tight group like ours. Having a hundred or more people listening in and chatting within the VC at any given time was a great reminder of how we became the great digital city we are today. Big thanks to OX Lannister and the real Paul Turner and many other citizens for filling in and facilitating great conversations within the VC. At any given point in the day, one could tune in and be familiarized with legal jargon, discussions on how one can attain Google certificates for management, talks of nutrition and big pharma and of course the riddles and all the trials and tribulations that the citizens had to get through to make it into the Citadel among a plethora of meaningful discussions. Damon says, that if you want the resource to exist again in NT, then join us and participate, even if you're just listening at your meat bag job. Okay, now that the gooey stuff is out the way, we can finally play some games and make some money. Over 400 citizens invested with SITCAP's Accelerator Program's first project round, raising $275,000 for Dr. JPEG's gaming project, Non-Fungible Arcade, or NFA. Apart from the bragging rights for investing in a kick-ass project, investors are set to receive equity in NFA and a guaranteed whitelist spot in their upcoming mint. Ben Gothard, the COO of NFA, noted that this was one small small step for NFA and the Citadel, one giant step for the gaming industry as we know it. We look forward to seeing NFA hitting combos and trick shots along their way to fulfilling their grand vision while SITCAP continues to provide a platform for projects that have what it takes to defeat the final boss. And speaking of a defeated boss, not even CZ's BNB is safe from the jaws of the vicious hackers lurking around Web3. In the week, BNB joined the list of centralized blockchains that needed to be halted due to a hack on the network. CZ tweeted that while he was asleep, an exploit on a cross-chain bridge, BSC Token Hub, resulted in extra BNB which then led to the team asking all validators to suspend BNB. Although the problem is now resolved and BNB is functioning properly, how safe are we really in crypto? I think I know somebody who has an idea. SITCAP is proud to announce a beacon of hope that is positioned to be their sixth investment that arises to protect the wary pioneers of this strange path. Bits Crunch uses AI analytics to provide NFT traders and buyers the tools to understand the NFT market, protect themselves against fraud, and make better, more informed decisions in buying and selling NFTs. Their key tools, called Scour, Liquify, Unleash NFTs, and Crunch Da Vinci, are going to be your new best friends, and you can learn more about these during the AMA hosted tomorrow, the 10th of October. All links related to SITCAP and Bits Crunch alongside important dates are linked within the article in the description. And we have more news coming to you shortly. Please don't leave your seats. We're going to be right back after this little intermission. All right, everybody, I'm going to be honest. I'm running out of ideas to ask you how to send Ethereum at ntnews.eth. So for this episode, I'm just going to let the audio run and you can imagine whatever it is that you want me to say. It's going to keep going. It'll cut out any second. I'm, I'm just here. I'm chilling. There's some great music, by the way. Was it Music Mainnet? Who made this? It's quite good. Like, you know, there's a real...
Oh, Phoenix Down pulled the plug on the music because he wants me to tell you about good habits. Man, that guy's a nerd sometimes. I'm joking, I'm joking. I know the Phoenix Down fans are going to come after me. Backed by Sam Bankman Freed's Eggplants, aka FTX Ventures, Pacer describes itself as the first wellness ecosystem super app with the intention to reward users for cultivating good, healthy habits into their daily routines. This includes getting good rest, practicing mindfulness and meditation, training to keep fit on a consistent basis and not investing more than you're willing to lose. I'm sure 80% of NFT bros are going to get no rewards off the last one. S1 and head of engagement for Pacer feigns of crypto dropped Phoenix down an access key to test the app and his first impression was rather positive interacting with the simple to navigate ecosystem and an interesting bit being the sleep to earn feature which is described in the white paper as the most fundamental aspect to a person's wellness. According to PD, the team behind Pacer is as strong as the features they're building in and with that in mind, there are upcoming Genesis NFT PFP Mint with a supply of 5,555 pieces is definitely a top left corner screamer. For more information, check out Pacer's introductory Medium article or their socials all linked below in the description. Moving on to our final two stories of the week. First up, Bleedkale is back again with the next big free Web3 gaming webinar brought to you by the team at Uptick. On the 12th of October, the co-founder of Axie Infinity, CTO of Animoca Brands, COO of Project Illoon and Bleedkale himself get together for a workshop focusing on the growth marketing strategies and hacks these teams have been implementing to create breakthrough gaming projects in the industry. The webinar is open to the general public and is a great opportunity for all to learn from some experts in the field so please click the article in the description and book your time in now and finally phoenix down is back again because he just can't get enough of the spotlight in the midst of long italian honeymoons over leveraged sports bets backing the wrong teams churning out killer youtube videos and building up the citadel's future one of our founding fathers is gearing up for a grand comeback into the grandma dunking league center court and ready to draymond green his way through the finals so if your name is jordan please get out the way that's right, Scoot's dad recently announced that his long-awaited studio should be up and running in the coming week so we can finally get our daily dose of shit talk, NFT advice, insightful information on how the Matrix has enslaved us, how coffee is rotting our brains, the importance of watching CEO interviews, how minimalism and living with one fork can help you amass a $100 million net worth, the fact that woke people are severely sleep-deprived, the blueprint to degenning, and also our favorite new podcast, which I think is the one thing social media is really lacking right now. A podcast. Sorry, Becker, you flew right into this. So, with his new studio soon to be ready to go, we can expect the good old content to return alongside some IRL projects he's got in the mix. This really sounds too good to be true. And that is all for this week's Neo Tokyo News Broadcast. This has been your host, Outer Citizen Shumsi number 769, bringing you the news powered by the NT News Team. Music brought to you by the team at Music Mainnet. We hope you enjoyed this broadcast and look forward to serving you day in and day out. Until next time, data streams connecting our minds, tying Neo Tokyo together.